Polaris flight, this is Bulldog. You're clear for takeoff. Proceed to that point, Alpha, and wait for further instructions. Heads up, lads. The Navy's here. Welcome aboard, mate. We'll try not to embarrass you too badly. This is Bulldog to all flights. Stand by to commence exercise. Watch your altitude and position at all times. I don't want anyone getting careless and hitting the side of a hill. Monroe, since you're the new man in the squadron, we'll be evaluating your performance first. Remember, your performance will be scored at the end of each segment. When you've completed the objectives for each segment, I'll clear you to proceed to the next one. That's it. All flights commence exercise. Repeat, commence exercise. All right, Polaris, your first training segment is basic air combat maneuvering. We'll begin with a basic gunnery exercise. We'll start with a large, slow-moving target. Check your radar. There's an AWACS plane flying a basic patrol circuit in the training area. Engage it with your cannon. Good. Now let's see if you can hit a more nimble target. Your new target is Polaris 1. Engage at will. Right then. Let's see what you've got. Lucky shot. Very good, Monroe. Carry on to the next segment. You're checked out on guns, Polaris. Now we're moving on to missiles. Now you'll engage two of your flight mates at the same time. Polaris 4, you're clear to engage Polaris 3 with your heat seekers. Begin. Adequate job, Monroe. Proceed to the next segment. All right, Polaris 4, you've had your fun. Now we see how well you do when you're on the wrong side of the missile. First, we'll practice decoying the incoming missiles using flares. Watch the missile indicator on your HUD. When it gets close, release a flare and make a sharp turn to decoy the missile. Remember, you only have a limited number of flares, so use them sparingly. The missiles will come at you from multiple vectors, so watch the warning prompt on your HUD. Ready? Here they come. Very good, Polaris 4. Now we're going to practice making tight turns to evade incoming missiles. Watch the missile indicator on your HUD. When the missile is very close, make a tight turn to dot out of its way. Again, the missiles will come at you from multiple vectors, so stay sharp. Here we go.
Good work, Monroe. It's clear you've mastered the basic concepts of dogfighting. All right, Monroe, you've demonstrated proficiency in each of the basic air combat evaluations. Now it's time to put it all together under more realistic combat conditions. On my mark, you will engage all three of your flight mates simultaneously while dodging incoming missile fire. Watch the threat indicators on your HUD and use all the techniques at your disposal to avoid enemy threats. On my mark, commence exercise. Watch out for this one, he knows how to shoot. Very impressive, Monroe. Very impressive indeed. Proceed to the next segment. Polaris flight, this is Bulldog. Index, index. We're terminating the exercise due to an emergency situation. Joint Training Command is tracking a civilian aircraft that has altered course and entered restricted airspace. It is not responding to radio calls, and unless we can establish contact, we have to assume it's been hijacked. Your orders are to intercept the aircraft to perform a visual inspection. Bulldog out. Unidentified aircraft. You are in restricted airspace. State your intentions immediately, or you risk being fired upon. Polaris 4, this is Bulldog. Take position at the plane 7 o'clock. Unidentified aircraft, this is Joint Training Command. This is your final warning. Good work, Polaris 4. We're reviewing the data feed now. That explosion was no accident. Someone planted a bomb on that plane. They must have detonated prematurely when they knew they'd been caught. Wreckage from the plane hit the base's runway, but damage is minor and there were no casualties. No way to tell who was responsible yet, but we'll get it sorted soon enough. Polaris Flight, you're clear to return to base for debrief. Congratulations, Monroe. That was a fine bit of flying. <laughs>